All right, Coach, obviously this past weekend you beat Toledo twice. Just talk about the confidence boost that that gives you is, you know, you play your home opener Wednesday and then, more importantly, the conference opener on Friday at Wright State. Well, it's a, lot, a big, big confidence, you know, especially uh, what Phil gave us yesterday um, with the 13 strikeouts, eight innings, um, you know, perfect to almost fifth inning or so. I mean, he was – he was dominant. Um, I was uh, very pleased that uh, even when he did give up a hit or two or there was an error, um, that uh, you know he was able to work out of uh, that particular inning and, and really um, attack the hitters. And, and that's what he really did yesterday was he pitched a contact, but his slider was really working, but he was locating the fastball as well. So everything was working for him yesterday. That has to be a big confidence for him. I know for as a coaching staff and team, it certainly was great to see him uh, come out the way he did uh, yesterday. Did he make any kind of adjustments over his past two starts? I mean, two starts, 1.380 ERA, 18 Ks, and 13 innings. Has he made an adjustment at all, or is it just he's doing what he's supposed to do? He's doing what he's supposed to do, but I, I think, though, you know, those early games, he did pitch well, you know, and, and I think that what really shows – you know, say in the box score is maybe an inning of a crooked number or so, but um, but he was still doing very well in those outings, in those next couple innings. We left him out there, and, and uh, he was doing very well. And, and I think on top of that, you know, at that time, we weren't scoring runs or getting base runners, you know, so uh, that didn't help matters either. But And, and so he's he's been doing well all year, and, uh, you know, and yesterday was the best uh, so far. In all three wins, your starter has gotten at least six. Is that something that you feel like you need to get length out of the starters? I mean, obviously all coaches want that, but with your situation, especially with the few number of arms in the bullpen, is that something that this team needs in order to win? No doubt, no doubt. You know, and uh, and and you know, we could have probably pushed them a little bit more at Tennessee, um, but uh, this past outing or this past weekend was important that. You know they would have been pushed, you know, regardless into the seventh, and and then he was dealing the eighth, and we were even going to let him, you know, go out to the ninth yesterday, but our bottom half of the eighth was a little long, and and so we just felt that it was better to, you know, just end him right there. Um, long innings and the bottom half for your half is obviously a good thing. Um, bats starting to come around a little bit. Um, same kind of question as Phil. Have they kind of made an adjustment, or is it more just? The season's starting to progress a little bit, and the bats are starting to catch up with the arms. They're, it's starting to catch up with the arms. They're seeing it a lot better. We're playing more games. You know, we're playing more games, so they're feeling a little bit more comfortable. Um, we're also doing a couple, you know, uh, different things on, you know, maybe we are hitting and running a little bit more to get the bats, you know, swinging a little bit more to, you know, uh, get them swinging. You know, maybe we were taking um, at times being too selective instead of uh, being more aggressive. Um, I know. I know. On Saturday, we left, you know, too many left on base um, on Saturday, and and we talked about that before yesterday's game about, you know, things are set in the stage. You know, a guy gets a bunt down, we do a good job of moving the runner to third, two outs, guy at third. We need to step up. Someone needs to step up with that big hit and and just relax. They got to trust their swing, let the ball travel, and uh, we did that yesterday. Um, we had a couple, I think we had three sack flies, two from Johnny Chris and one from Armani. And, um, you know, those were big. Those were big confidence boosters from those two guys. But in general, as a hitters, for us to be able to move the baseball and execute, and, and we did that yesterday. So I'm very excited about, you know, getting these guys going. I know, you know, Drew Doge is feeling it right now. He's starting to see it a lot better. Um, Jeremy uh, Banks, Leon, you know, five uh, for five the other day. Um, Yakabuchi, you know, Booch is starting to feel it pretty good a little bit now. Neil Schroth, I mean, the guys are just all starting to, um, you know, come up big in certain situations. Or, you know, we're hitting a lot of balls on the line too. You know, Saturday in that doubleheader, we had probably five or six that were outs. Um, they were hard outs. And so very pleased with, you know, hey, when, when you're starting to hit the ball hard like that and you get out, um, they're going to drop eventually. Wednesday's the scheduled home opener, you know, obviously, you know, with weather, that all can change. But just talk about whenever the home opener is, how good it'll feel to finally play in a game at home. You know, your first 17 have all been on the road. Oh, it's going to be tremendous. You know, I mean, we got a little taste of it this weekend uh, being the home team, um, even though we were on the road. But, uh, 
uh, that was certainly, uh, it was different, uh, you know, sending our pitcher out to the top of the first um, uh, this time. But it certainly is going to be feel, you know, feel pretty good to get out at Eastwood and, and be the home team and, and have our, uh, you being up there in the booth and, and uh, you know, our Jumbotron and, and everything else like that. But it's certainly, uh, you know, being on the road, being at home, it, it's going to be, it's going to feel pretty good. Um, and just real quick, um, you know, Wright State's obviously always one of the top teams in the league. Um, does it does it matter at all that you open up with them, or just talk about, I guess, in general, opening up conference play against them at their place? I, I just think our guys are, you know, and, and as a staff, we're excited to just start conference play. You know, we're we're playing, uh, you know, seventeen games in, and and uh, you're ready for conference. You're ready to get get going to what what you know what what really happens what really is uh you know why we're playing you know the conference is very tough from top to bottom you know playing right state uh, year after year well coached you know well executed team um we look forward to the challenge this weekend and uh you know hey it's the first weekend we got to we got to get going you know and and uh but we're we're excited to to go down there this weekend and and uh we'll get in some good practices before then um, and uh, we'll be in good shape.